Hello everybody. Today what we're going to do is we are going to be finding total volume. Now as you know, to find volume of a rectangular prism, we multiply length times width times height. Or we multiply base times height. Now we're going to take a look at a shape that is not a rectangular prism, but is actually two rectangular prisms. So I need to look at this shape and I need to divide it up to make two rectangular prisms. Now I have two rectangular prisms. If I put this line across here, if you take a look, this is a rectangular prism here. Okay, we got our length and width and the height goes down. And this is another rectangular prism. And we have our length and width and height right here. So now we are going to solve for volume for these two and then just add them up. So if we look at the bottom one, we see that we have a length and a 5 and a width of 3 and a height of 2. So I'm just going to multiply 5 times 3 times 2. 5 times 3 is 15. 15 times 2 is 30. So that's going to equal 30. Now let's take a look at this top up here. I see the width is 3. The length here it's not 7 because that would be the whole thing. So we have to take this 3 off of 7. So we think 7 minus 3 is going to tell me that it's going to be 4 for right here. This is going to be 4 for this area. So now we know that we're going to multiply 4 times 3 for, for our length times width. And then our height, again, is going to be 2. So if we do that, we have 4 times 3 is 12. 12 times 2 is 24. Now, to find our total volume, we need to add 24 plus 30. And our answer is going to be 54. And we have to always label it. So volume here equals 54. And these are in centimeters, so it's going to be centimeters cubed. And we always have to remember with volume, we have to label it cubed. Okay, so now you have a couple to practice. Good luck on it, and don't forget to look back at the video if you need some help. Thanks.